watching KCWY, where news comes first. This is News 13 at Noon. Welcome back, everyone. It's time to get into the Christmas spirit with a classic Christmas story. We're talking about a Christmas carol. I've got Trevor Trujillo, who plays Scrooge, and Jason Nabalski, who plays Charles Dickens. And they're here to tell us more about this festive production. Guys, thanks so much for being here with us. Thank you. So tell us, you know, I'm familiar with the story. I loved it as a kid, but maybe there's some people out there not so familiar with the story. Can you give us a little rundown of what to expect? Uh, for those unfortunate enough not to know the magic of a Christmas carol, it's a uh about a miserly old man, Ebenezer Scrooge, who's uh, lived his life uh, very selfishly. And uh, he has one last chance to redeem himself before he is burdened with the uh, afterlife of having to deal with his life. And so he gets the help of uh, three spirits to uh, imbue him with the Christmas spirit and uh, he can live a clean life. That sounds like a great story. I love it. And Casper College is going to be putting this on your theater and dance department we're talking mm -hmm. about here. Um, when is the show going to be on? Uh, we have tonight and tomorrow night, mm -hmm. and then Tuesday through Saturday. And we have two shows on Saturday. We have a matinee and then an evening show. And what time are those? Uh, 7.30 is curtain, so okay. it'll be there about 7. Okay, and then 2 o'clock for the matinee. Yeah, 2 o'clock matinee. Great. And how much are tickets? $12. And uh, they are ten dollars for children. Yep. And I believe uh, full-time students get uh, free tickets. Yeah, I think so. Oh, there you go. Great. And how? I mean, a lot of people in this state. Is it a stadium theater? It's a theater. It, it, it's a largest theater. We could uh, probably yeah. accommodate a little over two hundred. Yeah. Okay, great. And uh, you know, Casper College is putting on this production. Some college students involved. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, some interesting elements you've got going on here. Yeah. Uh, actually, uh, it's th this is the fourth time that Casper College has done this particular uh, story, mm -hmm. and it's a different adaptation each time. This particular adaptation was originally done by the Guthrie Theater in Minnesota. And uh, this is uh, kind of marking a return to the classic uh, way of telling the story, but uh, Jason here plays uh, Charles Dickens. Yeah, Charles Dickens. And that's kind of the X factor in this one. That's yeah, kind of cool. I narrate, I narrate the whole story through that. So, I mean, I don't get to interact with anybody. I think Trevor and I have an interaction towards the very, very end. Mm -hmm. Other than that, I just kind of stand off and narrate as if I'm watching my story unfold in front of me. Mm -hmm. So it's pretty cool. And talk to me a little bit about the makeup. He's got it worse than I do. <laughs> we, we both have pretty extensive makeup. A lot of research went into Jason's. Yeah, uh, they tried to make huge him beard. Yeah. They tried to make him look as much like Charles Dickens about his uh, 32 years old as yep. they could. Mm -hmm. And then me, uh, transforming me into a 70-year-old uh, man. He's got an hour before call. Yeah. He's got um, an hour before any of us. Yeah, we have about two hours worth of makeup. <laughs> and, right. Uh, you know, they, they take my hairline back to here. I've got a uh, nice big hunkin' yeah. bird nose. Uh -huh. And uh, they were good enough to let me keep my own hair. It's, it's, yeah. all, it's all I have to wear effect. a wig. But, uh, yeah. I wear a wig and a fake goatee. <laughs> they, they, they say this is the, uh, the most they've done with makeup in several years. Wow, yeah. that's really cool stuff. And uh, putting a lot of time into this show. I mean, how long have you guys been practicing? A month. Actually, yeah, this is, this is one of our quick turnarounds. We had yeah. a month to do this one. Yeah, we started rehearsals November 1st. Mm -hmm. I think it was. All right. Great. Thank you so much, Je yeah. uh, Jason and Trevor. Sorry, I <laughs> stumbled on your <laughs> names there. Look forward to seeing you at Casper okay. College's version of A Christmas Carol. Come on up. All right. Still to come on News 13 at noon, we've got meteorologist Alex Kirchner. He's on deck, and he'll have another check of your weather forecast. Stick with us.